What is going on y'all and welcome back to the channel. I am your host, Unknown Factions, and thank you for joining me for some more Valheim. And today, I'm going to be bringing y'all something special. I accidentally blew up the refinery and a house earlier with it, but that's besides the point. First, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button for me. Both are greatly appreciated and it helps me out a lot. Now, upon trying to crack this easter egg that we've been hinted at, I found this special item right here. The cheat sledge and go figure it really is a cheat weapon now this is not a spawn i mean a, a craftable item in the game you do have to be in dev commands and spawn this in but as i know many people are and you taking advantage of this tool just to build and test builds this can be a extremely useful tool right here now this thing does stupid damage i mean it's 9999s all the way across the board it is the ultimate troll weapon so be weary please do back up your servers because when people get their hands on this it does devastating damage i mean you are about to see for yourself now it doesn't glow when you pick it up of course that's just a like when you drop it effect like you can throw it back down and it still glows again just looks like your normal iron sledgehammer but now right here when you look at the stats as you can see 99,999 damage in the area effect on this weapon is insane i mean it reaches like a complete 20 block perimeter and it goes up like multiple stories it's huge now as you can see this house right here that i am about to sacrifice it took a lot of time to build i, I gave up on it a long time ago this was going to be like an ocean mead hall with a big patio back porch or whatever you know i just said f it a long time ago but it's still very pretty you know and unfortunately it is going to fall victim to the cheat sledge today. And the reason being, if you haven't noticed, it is extremely laggy around here. My instances are right around 30,000, which is insane, way too stupid, unplayable. So this is a very useful tool. I mean, if you have a overcrowded area, you can just come through and wipe things out very fast. No need for workbenches. And as you see... Yeah! A one hitter quitter for most buildings. I mean, look at that. Completely demolished. One swing right in the center. And that was a 20 by 20 building right there. Almost four stories tall. Completely gone. And that was way sped up. I had to clip out like completely three minutes of me just sitting there looking at popcorn blown up on the screen. I mean, my computer about crashed. That was intense. So, you know, try, try not to do too big, you know, maybe stand on the outside and whittle it off because it works a lot better and you can hit things from really far away, like, watch right here. See, bam, it has such a high reach up, you know, so very, so very useful right there. And of course, dangerous if you don't back your server up. Oh, you don't want kids running around on your server with these spawning them in and then coming into your map and just blowing things up. I'm kind of sorry for putting it out there like that, but you know, always back your server up. If you don't, you could lose everything to somebody running around with one of these bad boys because they are in the game. You do not need mods to have this hammer. So be wary, save your files, don't lose your house. Now, if y'all want to see what this thing does to Yagulf, Let's find out right now. Oh, here he comes. Could it be? Bow! Right to the kisser. Yeah, one hit. He's done. I mean, unstoppable. I, mean, I don't actually, I should look up how much health Yagold has. I don't know, but it's probably not uh, 99,000, obviously. <laughs> oh, he's eager. I killed some deers over there in the process. But that's it, y'all. That's the secret hammer. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please do hit that like button for me and if you're not subscribed subscribe what are you doing with yourself but i appreciate you guys stopping by and i will catch you in the next one